Hey guys, ProTaku82, welcome to another unboxing video. But first, let me show you this bargain bin DVD I got from Big Lots. See right there? For $3. This is the Skycrawlers. This is from the production studio and director that brought us Ghost in the Shell. Yeah, I'm also aware that there's also a Blu-ray re release of this. So hopefully I can get that counterpart soon, but for now this will have to do. See if I can open this. There we go. Sometimes they can be a pain to open. Okay. Oh. You know what? Just to save time, I'll just do this. There we go. No insert. Just a disc. Okay, I'm going to set this aside for a moment. While I do the actual unboxing here. Now I have two boxes. This white box is from Lone Star Comics, a.k.a. my comic shop. The one on the bottom is from Right Stuff. So, let's open this one here first. Oops. Hold on a second, folks. Yeah, I don't want to show my address on the video. Personal reasons. Because the receipts is like stuck to the... There we go. Okay, now I'm going to lay this flat. This tape is a pain to cut open. There we go. Oh. Tape is like stuck on here. Oops, I gotta be careful. I don't want to ruin the pages. Whoa. Also sealed in a plastic bag here. There we go. Let's see if I can get this out. Very carefully. There we go. Okay, this is an issue of Raijin Comics. This is issue number eight. Now, this is a now defunct and long forgotten manga anthology. This was once a weekly anthology. And then it turned monthly. This publication lasts for about nearly two years. Now the only issue I'm missing out of this is issue number three. So once I get that at some point. I'll show you every issue I've got of this in a future video. And it's got some of these in the anthology at the time of this issue. Like American Dream, Fist of the Blue Sky, Slam Dunk, Baki the Grappler, Revenge of Moflon, I think that's how I pronounce it. The First President of Japan, City Hunter, and Bomber Girl. Okay, I'll set this aside for a moment while I open this other box. Like I said, this is from Right Stuff, and most of the box is like beaten up. But at least it's easier to open. Oops. Okay, I'm just trying to. This is a slightly bigger box here. Toss that aside. Let's see what this is. 
sort of know what this is, but you guys don't. Wow, this is so much bigger in person. Okay, this is the first box set of Toradora. This is the premium edition version. I picked this up because I heard that this is just gone out of print. It discontinued. And this box is huge. Same thing on the other side, I guess. Nope, it ain't. The other side's not in color, but this side is. So let's see what's inside. It opens up from the top, which I find rather interesting. I also heard that Wagnaria is also in the same boat. It just got discontinued. Uh, print, and of course, I just ordered it as soon as I find out or found out that the premium edition. These will get replaced with regular editions eventually once they sell out. Okay, this is the first case. It's in a. Each of these are in a fin pack case. Here's some artwork. I don't know if you can see or not. There's the disc itself. I almost forgot to mention this is from NIS America, which just started releasing anime about a year ago or so. Whoops. And here's the other case. Contained disc 2. It's a 2 disc set. I'm hoping to get the uh, second half of it before they announce that it's going to get discontinued too eventually. And there's the disc itself. Now let's, let's show you this oversized episode guide book. Which is probably the main reason why this box is so huge. I don't know if I can get it all in one, get it all in one shot here. Okay. Basically, it's just an episode guy with some uh, artwork and stuff. With some character profiles. Some key terms. Interview. And uh, some interesting tidbits right here. There's the interview with Yuri Hori, who's a popular seiyu and J-pop singer. Yeah, it's got some character profiles, interviews, episode, episode information, and so much more. Okay, I think this is the last page. Is it? No, it isn't just stuck together. And on the back is some credits and stuff. Yeah, same as the art box. So yeah, this is no longer available at Right Stuff, unfortunately. So you're just gonna have to like track it down and probably pay slightly higher price for this thing. Anyway, let me set up everything here. Okay, so anyway, this is what I got the other day. Thank you for watching this unboxing video. It's Protocoly 2. Take care, and I'll see you guys next time.